Okay, so it's it's early in the morning. Well, not too early, like seven something. Uh, and uh, I just found out that there's an area not too far from us. Uh, it's called Sheffield Mills, I believe it is, that do a bald eagle feeding this time of year. Yeah, so uh, they do it like twice a day, 9 a.m., somewhere in that range, 9 a.m. and 11, I think it is. But they could get, you know, a couple eagles up to like dozens of eagles come in for this feeding so i'm packing up the old sigma sigma what is it 150 to 600 mil lens i think it is uh and i'm gonna go out and see if i can get some shots okay so i got the bag all packed up uh done some research uh for shooting eagles and they were just like here's my tip i guess if you guys are out there trying to shoot eagles um one what do they say? One twelve fifty, I think it was. Uh, so one over twelve fifty for shutter speed if they're kind of stationary as a minimum, and as a minimum uh, one three thousandths of a second for them in flight if you want to get it sharp. So um, I'm hoping we have a lot of light. It's early now, but by the time we actually get out there, we should we should have some good good daylight, and. Uh, one three thousandths of a second. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to shoot at that or or higher. Yeah, and um, the only other issue, the issue that I'm having right now with shooting with a big 150 to 600, is finding a bag that is big enough to carry it. Okay, I was thinking maybe I should bring sunglasses, but I decided against it. Yep, and car is running. Seems a little cold. Got my map. And my lens fit in my bag, which is excellent. I, I had to just redo a couple of the dividers so that it actually fits, but um, let's go take some pictures. Kind of exciting. All right, guys, so we're here, and I was a little concerned that I wouldn't be able to find it, but. There's lots of people here. So we're gonna follow them and uh, go shoot some birds.
okay, so that that was stupid amounts of fun. Uh, I don't know what I got for video, to be completely honest with you, because they move so fast. They move so fast. You know, they come, they come down. You don't even know they're coming. Then they're in the shot, and then you you spray and pray is what you kind of do. Spray and pray. So uh, I'm gonna go. Uh, see see if I got anything and uh, I shot some really wide videos so I'm not sure I'm not sure what that's like but again we'll find out okay home oh. I ended up actually going back yeah because uh, I wanted a different tripod to shoot video so I got, I got this one. I got this one. Oh. And it worked way better. Way better, because I was trying to shoot video. So this time, went back, shot video. And uh, now I'm gonna go take a look. And Harley came with me for the second time, because I went and picked up, picked up uh, Harley after school. Okay, so I'm I'm back in the house, and uh, I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna kind of finish the video, kind of kind of here a little bit. Um, I took just shy 591 photos, 591 photos, uh, a bunch of videos. Like I said, I had to go back. So you want to make sure if you're shooting with like a 600 mil. Things like Eagle, because they, I think they can fly like 60 kilometers an hour or 60 miles an hour or something crazy like that. And uh, so they're hard to track. So you got to shoot a lot to get a bunch. But uh, video, I'm actually really happy with. I did have to run a little bit through a bit of a stabilizer, but that's okay. Uh, and for you guys, just if you want, uh, I'm going to put up like, I don't know, 10 or so, 10 or 15 of my favorite photos that uh, I captured. I'm pleased. I am. I'm pleased. So if you guys are ever in Nova Scotia in the winter, uh, Sheffield Mills, I think it's called, uh, eagle feeding. Make sure you make sure you put that on your agenda. Even if you're not a photographer, you know, it's just really cool to go out and see it. Yeah. All right, guys. That's it for today's vlog. I'm gonna I'm gonna go play with more of my foot with more of my photos because fun.